guys, it's Kayla and I am here for you today with another plan with me. This is for the week of January 8th through the 14th. Um, today I'm using a Sticky Essentials kit. Um, I believe it's something about cozy. Um, the quote box says it's the coziest time of the year. Um, so I'm just going to go through the kit really quick. So we have the full boxes, functional, Boxes and appointment labels and flags, headers and littles, ombre heart checklists, these awesome kind of like marbly, the silver's kind of like a marbly glitter, glitter headers, the uh, date covers and deco, and washi and habits. I am obsessed with this kit, so we're just going to get started. Um, I think for this week I'm going to go back to my white space style planning that kind of looks like this. Um, because I've missed it. And last week, for the start of the new year, I went back to my traditional planning. So we're going to just kind of switch back and forth. I'm kind of in a place where I want to switch up my planning, but I don't know what to do. So I'm just kind of going to go between my two styles for a little bit until I find my planner piece. <laughs> um, but for now... This is the plan. Ugh. So yes, I'm obsessed with this snowflake washi. It hasn't snowed here since Christmas Eve. It snowed Christmas Eve. A little bit on Christmas Day, actually. Um, I don't think it'll probably snow here again until March, if I'm being honest. But we'll see. Alright, so that's all I need from this sheet for now. Um, I... Let's see, do I want to do date to hook date covers? We'll come back to that at the end. If I think I need them, I will use them at the end, but I don't know yet. So, I need my glitter headers and my checklists and my full boxes. So, I can do the whole shebang. So, I'm going to go black glitter header. Let's see if I can remember how to do this. Without having to flip back too many times. I got a black letter header, black checklist, black glitter header, and then is this a full box or an empty space? Full box. Um, so Monday's pretty busy, so I'm going to use this ta coffee table and rug combo, because I don't mind covering that. It's super pretty, but I'm not super attached to it, so I like that. And then another glitter header. Awesome. I like that there's some like dark colors and some super girly colors in this kit. Yeah, I kind of felt that way about last week's kit, too. But this one's a little bit more dark. Okay, so then Tuesday goes glitter header. Okay, the full box is on the bottom. Perfect. I'll get back in the hang of this. Okay, I was just really missing this style, so I decided I'm going to do it this week. And then we'll see... Ooh. Um, yeah, this would be dark pink. Oh no. That's fine. I just have to go out of order. It's okay. I'm like, yeah, oh, what am I doing? But I know what I'm doing, so we're fine. Um, but yeah, I've, just, I've been kind of missing this style, and I think this might be where I want to stick for a few months, but I haven't quite decided yet. So I thought I might as well go back to it for a day. I'm also trying to order. I need to order. I haven't done it yet, but I'm going to order some shops, some kits from different shops. Um, and just kind of see if anything strikes me um, at, for a new style of planning based on what um, is in those shops kits. Because um, I kind of get stuck in my shops that I always use. My scroll prints and sticky essentials and um, paisley prints. Those are kind of my standard shops at Planner Face. There's a couple, but all of their kits contain 
in some combinations, some have more than others, but the same sorts of things. Um, so I kind of get trapped in the same styles, which isn't necessarily bad because I do like all those shop stickers, so I'm using stuff that I like. Um, but I don't know, I kind of want to branch out a little. I'm not entirely sure how I feel about the silver with the taupe. Because all the rest of the stuff in the kit is more of a taupe, except for the stuff on the glitter sampler is like silver. I don't know, but I like the silver and I like the taupe separately. Don't know how I feel about them together. Um, let's do something lighter. <laughs> But yeah, so I'm trying to look for some new shops. If you have any suggestions of shops, leave them below. Um, because I have another Sticky Essentials and another Scribble Prints order coming in this this week or next week. Um, but I feel like I should be branching out a little more. Okay, Thursday. The okay, full box goes in the bottom. <laughs> I'm like, where am I? So yeah. So let me know if you have any thoughts on different shops I should be trying. Um, people who plan differently than like the two. I feel like there are like two major ways that everyone on YouTube plans. And it's either like the whole no white space with the full box checklist. Using all your full boxes. Um, like that. Or then there's kind of the style that's all white space. And most people who do white space don't use checklists. I find it necessary to have a checklist every day. Um, so for me, I have to do it this way. Um, I have to have the checklist, even my white space. But I feel like there's then that one style of white space that everyone does. That's gorgeous. I don't have pretty enough handwriting, I don't think, for the way I do this now. But I am trying my best. Um, but I feel like those are the like two styles I always see, and I don't see anything really different. Like my white space is different, like compared to other people's, and it's not really that different or special. Um, I'm trying to think of which day I want to use the girl because I don't want to cover her because I really like her. Um, so I'm thinking I might need to use her on like Sunday or Saturday. Yeah, one of those days. So I'm going to use the, mm, the horse bust on Thursday. Like I don't know what do I want to use. So yeah, so I'm just kind of like, I want to do something different, but I get stuck in the same old ways, so I don't know. We'll see what the new year brings as far as planning. Okay, so that is a blank one. My full box goes here, so I'm going to go with the black flowers. Ooh, come on. <laughs> Yes. Um, I kind of failed last week at my New Year's resolutions, which I'll talk about a little more in Wednesday's video, which will be about my New Year's resolutions. Um, my goal was to get three videos up a week, um, which is still my goal. I think last week I just kind of needed a, like, welcome to the new year detox week. Um, and so I took it. I only got one video up. I was a little bit disappointed in myself. Um, but it was fine. The world did not end because I didn't upload two more videos last week. Um, I'm trying to give myself a little bit more grace. I usually like, beat myself up really bad if I like didn't put upload a video when I said I would. And I'm trying to be like, you know what? I'm human. It's gonna happen sometimes. Um, and I just gotta like move on. Um, but it's hard because like I want to be putting out content and being consistent on content, um, but I'm also human and I have a full-time job and two part-time jobs and YouTube, which is also really a full-time job. Um, so it's hard not to get like down on myself about it though. I'm like, I should have done this, but I am only one person. There's only so much I can do. Um, my, I have a family member who's in the hospital this week, um, and that's been another thing. I was like, I was supposed to upload last Wednesday, and then I didn't because I just was tired. Um, and then I was supposed to up upload Friday. I was like, perfect, I'll film on Thursday, upload Friday. Then I ended up having a family member go to the hospital on Thursday, and I was like, nope, don't think I'm going to film today. Um, so it's just been like, that has 
been my priority this week, obviously. Um, sick family member kind of comes first before YouTube. Weird how that works. Um, but I knew I had to get my plan for me up because I had to plan for the week and it's not that much harder to pull out my camera um, and talk while I plan because I would just be like watching YouTube videos or talking to my sister if I was just planning on my own anyway. So might as well put out the camera, have better lighting to plan with. Let's be real, that's one of the big benefit here is I have better light when I <laughs> film um, plan with me's. Um, but yeah, so I'm like, I'm going to do it because if anything, I'm going to get a plan with me up every week is my goal or a planner video of some sort. I don't know if I'll do plan with me's any week, every week, but though I kind of enjoy them. It like makes me plan with a purpose, like so that I'm not just like, I'm just going to sit here for hours and then waste my time away on a vid watching a video and then realize, oh, I probably needed to like actually plan and <laughs> Yeah, so I like, I'm like, okay, I don't want this video to be more than like a half hour long, so I've got to like get to work. Um, my weekend banner. No, what's the point of having double boxes there if I don't put the weekend banner? So I'm going to put it over her body. Okay. So there's the base down. So now I can kind of go day by day. So, I have my pile of orange sticky notes. That's my sidebar. So, let's do littles. This is kind of a busy first half of the week, and then not so much the rest of the week. We're back. <laughs> so, yeah. So, I figure if I'm actually like, sitting down to plan, I might actually figure out what I'm doing the rest of the week. We'll see. Um, but I honestly don't mind, like, not knowing 100% what's happening this week, because means I have room to make plans. <laughs> okay, so there is dinner. So, Monday. Um, I have two TV shows. Okay. And a package. No, package is on Tuesday. Okay, so two TV shows. <laughs> so, I have Bachelor. And I have The Good Doctor. Okay. And then Tuesday I have um, This Is Us. Wednesday I don't have any TV shows back yet. Thursday I have The Good Place. Um, so Thursday I need a black... And then Sunday I have um, Shark Tank. And that's all that's back this week, I'm pretty sure. It's so next week where like all the CW and all the ABC shows come back. That's the ABC shows. So that's when it gets crazy is next week. I think. And then March gets even crazier and it's just, yeah, that's how it works. Um, on Tuesday I have a package. So, the light pink package sticker. I have some stuff from Ulta coming in. I suppose I have stickers coming this week, but I don't know which day. Um, so I'm going to ignore those. Um, I think I'm going to mark the days I'm going to the gym with the hearts. Because um, a couple days I'm doing it at home, and then a couple days I'm going to the gym. I think I'm having four days at the gym this week. We'll see. So Monday I need one. And so I'm on light pink. I need some workout stickers. If you know any shops have good workout stickers, leave those below. Tuesday I'm going to the gym and I need black. Wednesday I believe is an at home day. Yep. Thursday I'm going to the gym. Uh, Thursday I need a dark pink. Perfect. I believe Saturday's, uh, Friday's not home. Yep, and then Saturday is going to the gym. And so I need the gray. Oh, that worked out perfectly. I needed all the right stickers. <laughs> and then Sunday is my rest day, which I think I brought out something to mark that, but I'll mark it. 
a different way when I go to mark my at-home workouts, which actually I might mark those with the asterisk stickers, since I don't have workout stickers right now. Yeah, so for Wednesday, I need an at-home one. For Friday, I need an at-home one. Um, gray, that would also have been light pink, so I'm going to go with dark pink. And then Sunday is my rest day, so I'll mark that a different way. Okay, so those are my little things. That is what I have. Um, so then back to Monday, I have a video, so I need to get out those stickers. Um, trying to figure out which colors I want to use. So I don't think there's anything left on these sheets that match these kits. Great. And there's not much on these either. So, and I have three videos to go up this week. <laughs> So, we're definitely going to use this grayish color. Um, and then I think we'll use this burgundy-ish color. So, for Monday, I need one of the gray. Whoo, Monday is full up. It's fine. Wednesday, I'm going to use the burgundy-ish color. And then Friday, I will use that grayish color again. Okay. Saturday, I have a bill due. So I'm going to use um, the light pink. I lied, not the black. So there is that. This guy back down somewhere. No, that sheet. Don't throw that sheet away. Put this guy. And try and put it back where it belongs. <laughs> okay, good enough. So there's that. So Monday I have only a to-do left to put two to-dos left to put on there. Tuesday I have well work. I still need to do every day and tutoring. Um, so for work, I think I'm going to do over the washi, which is frustrating, but it's fine. And I'm going to use, oh, I really like these marble quarter boxes, but I don't have enough of them. I guess I could do four of those and then the silver. Yeah, let's do that. So Wednesday will be silver. And then the rest of the days will be these fun marble ones. Ooh, these are just going to be crooked. Because this sticker paper sticks well to itself. I don't really like how this looks, but I just had a lot going on. So, and I really like these full boxes, and I don't really want to cover them all. All right. There's work for the week. Now, I don't know if I'll work this day because it's a half day, but whatever. Okay, then I need to put in boxes for tutoring, um, but I think I'm just going to use appointment labels for that because they're smaller. Or I could use flags. Do I have any smaller flags? Not really. Okay, so we're going to use appointment labels. So I tutor on Tuesday, so I'm going to use the light pink on Tuesday. And then on Thursday, and on Thursday I'm going to use the gray. Those are the days that I tutor. Awesome. Um, okay. Let's make sure I'm not missing anything. Awesome. And then Sunday, I need to mark that it's my rest day. So for that, I'm going to take these little fox and cactus face masks. I'll take the pink one. I'm going to put that up here. So this is rest day. 
from working out, but it's also actually a work day. So I'm going to take the gray ones more with love working girl stickers and put that down here because it's going to be actually a pretty serious YouTube work day. Um, but it's my rest day from working out for the week. So got to mark that somehow. Um, so that's what goes going on this week as far as I know. Um, so it actually is going to look pretty full, which is awesome, but there's still so much time for so many things to be added. Okay, sidebar. <laughs> so I need my last full box. And that is now garbage. Alright, so now I need my washi and my weeklies and okay, all this stuff. So I'm going to start with my two habit trackers. One this week is going to be workouts um, and the other is going to be social media. Making sure I'm staying engaged with all that jazz. Um, because that's important to me, especially because I was really bad at it last week. Um, so that's my goal for this week, is to get back into it. So there are those. Um, then I need just a to-do list for this week. So I'm going to take um, some more washi first. take a black to-do header. Then a dark pink checkbox. Beautiful. And then another piece of washi. And then I'm going to take the gray weekly ombre. Awesome. All right. So that is this week. So I'm going to go ahead and write in everything and then check back in with you. All right, and here is the finished product. I just went ahead and I used my um, Paper Mate Ink Joy Gel uh, 0.5 in black. Um, I went in and added some icons here. I want to add icons for tutoring. Um, so I'm going to take the pencil for this day, um, and the book for this day, um, because I want to make sure I have icons there, but yeah, so that is what I've got for this week, I had a few to-dos to add in, um, and those will expand, I still don't know what I'm going to upload on Friday video-wise, so that still has to be decided, and that will be filled in, and I only know one day of work this week, so... Not super helpful, um, but yeah, that's what I know. So I will talk to you guys on Wednesday with my New Year's resolutions to tell you about how I already broke a few of them. All right, bye. <laughs>